we have to do a video about the latest technology update when it comes to text-to-speech, speech-to-text AI. But like a minute ago, MP just showed me a video about the new DJI Mavic Pro 2. We have to talk about that as well. We have one. Not the new one, we have the old one. Artificial intelligence is powering most of the stuff around us already. So when we talk about this drone, the new one, this one here is already quite smart. But the new one has, of course, a lot of improvements when it comes to the optics. So you can imagine, for example, that what you see here is way more powerful compared to that drone. But you also have all the stabilization. So you have sensors everywhere around. The drone can like stay away from any object you have in the air when you're flying. And most important, it tracks the object that you're filming. So it stays focused and it can follow the object. It's quite smart. There are some crazy videos here. So if people would ask, why would you improve on that? The new stuff they do here, they already put AI in there to like make it work better for you that you can focus on the actual product. Big difference. And now also the Google update. What Google does, there is this project called Google WaveNet where this Google duplex thing comes from. We talked about that in another video. But now they improved the languages. So you have, I think, 14 more languages that actually can translate text to speech. So it can speak more naturally. And more important, you now have the option that you can track several speakers. So just imagine I'm here having a meeting, not with myself, but with MP, with maybe Tessa, with maybe someone else. So we sit with four people here. Then the speech to text engine can recognize who's speaking, actually already taking notes, follow the, the conversation, like learning throughout the conversation and then actually giving action notes to the speakers. So this goes already in the direction that you like can record a meeting and you have all the action notes recorded. That's a very simple way to think of that. There are most likely way more creative ways to think of what you can do with that. What I want to say is, if you look at stuff that is developing, we're already beyond the age of hardware improvement. We're already way into the age of like using artificial intelligence to improve stuff. So it's improving itself on the way. It's exciting. I, I really love that. That's why it's important to talk about this. And we, we need a new toy, definitely, that's for sure. And also to talk about what's in the AI behind Google and all the other companies who push that. I hope that was helpful. It was helpful for me because it was an update. I just learned about that. And uh, so talking about that helps me a lot. Thanks for watching and see you guys next week.